Hello again. Time for some more daily Turtle War. Medieval 2, stainless steel. Um, turn this up a little bit. So there will be more content on writing uh, coming tomorrow. And um, we'll be even do some history content pretty soon as well. Which, sounds pretty, which is pretty cool. Um, I just thought the, there's been a lot of stops starting with, with my Total War stuff. So See, I wanted to... Is good with us. I wanted to um, make sure that we could, you know, get going and actually finish the series. In Vanessa's it's not your forces I hide from, Lord. Rest assured, you are not my target. <clears throat> okay, we should just um, end the turn here, I think. Yeah. I have plans for the Crusades. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um, I have plans for them. So, I'll show you the, the family tree in a minute. But uh, there are definitely a few people in the tree who are going to be Crusaders. Um, because quite simply, I need... Their bonus, to be honest with you. I, 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 need, I need them to give me good reputation with the Pope. <coughs> so when we get a new king, that's exactly what we're going to do. Um, I'm not going to make <laughs> Harkin commit suicide, even though I could. Just stick him in a ship and send him off to uh, to, to drown. But, uh, but I'm not going to do that. He's going to die of natural causes. <coughs> that was the King of France who died over there. Wow. Mm. That's fine for me. <clears throat> Whose time is up? Okay. Need to be very that's careful all here. I need. A target, please. That's all I need. A target, please. Probably not going to work, but always in his barrel. Shall bother you no longer. Hmm. It might be time to get rid of Scotland, you know. None of our fleet are leaving. Blockaded now, Lord. Who is my target? Scotland will fight ye for these waters. <laughs> As you wish. Today. You no doubt harbor desires most foul. Can I help, my lord? This at best be good. You're very hard to trust. Um.
<laughs> They've only got Bruges. You're gonna have to pay a war on Demonty. No, we cannot quite accept this. You wanna give me more money, but you don't wanna give me enough information. Fine. You'll accept? Excellent! Fine. A pleasure, noble sire. We could do without, you know, um, any of that rubbish. Set sail. We've taken Scotland from Scotland, so, you know. And we can get rid of all these mercs now, I think. Okay, 279 to 173. Mm, they're not that expensive, actually. <coughs> you keep them. Okay, so we could go up against England, but uh, yes, moving quietly. Ah. I think I may have found Novgorod. Yes, we have. Good. Moving into position. Until more. We found Novgorod. I am no diplomat, Sadiq. I am but Allah's servant. <coughs> Whose time is up? The target, please. That's all I need. Yes, I will leave nothing standing. Good. Who is it? Oh, there there. Who is my target? On my way. And kill him if he's in your way. That's all, all I need. <laughs> Good. Whose time is up? Who is my target? Not an option, my lord. The target, please. That's all I need. You Death keep saying that, but you, then you don't do anything, so... Um, okay, next next target then. I need to figure out who's going to be. Part of me wants Nov... Yeah, it's probably going to be Novgorod. <clears throat> well, I might save them until I'm back in the Pope's Good Graces. Because uh, they don't care about me fighting other Christians like that. Do you know yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to have England first. I'm going to do England first. They're training an army down there.
part two, Kings of Jerusalem dead in the same turn. Surely not. Okay, so who are you guys allied with? Crusader states are gone. Wow. So, who are England? Um, allies with Holy Roman Empire. And so that could be bad for us. If if the Holy Roman Empire turn around and side with England, that could be very bad. Um, if you wish to parley, noble sire, send an emissary. I will make them fear you. We march tomorrow. Give me some Scottish axemen. My lord. Orders, my king. Orders, my king. Glen my lord. Raiders? Yes. Orders, my king. Yes. Orders, my king. <laughs> of course. An order. <laughs> Can sell no further today. Big army coming across from there as well. Sire, very good lord. My lord. Factions are beating back the Crusaders, it seems. York's pretty much our town anyway. I mean, you know, Jorvik. I think, <clears throat> in all honesty, when Harkin dies and Magnus Not takes the throne, the um, yeah, when when Harkin dies and Magnus takes the throne, I think what I'm going to do is have um, Harkin will come over here. This will be his last conquest before he basically he dies. Um, yes, my lord. And then, yeah, we, we'll have his son will go on a crusade to um, the Middle East. <clears throat> da, set sail.
Okay, England has a lot of forces, so. Orders, my king. Combining troops. Whose time is up? The target, please. That's all I need. He has brought this upon himself. Who is my target? The target, please. That's all I need. That's a Wallace. The target, please. That's all I need. The target, please. That's all I need. On my way. Trying to make sure that we can get all of our cool things done. We want lots of Inverness to be a big recruiting centre up okay. there. Whose time oh, is up? They kill him. Why not? The target, please. That's all I need. They shall bother you no longer. What happens if you destroy the Papal States? I wonder if the Pope's still there, still around. I remember on one save game in the original game, um, I was actually in battle against the Pope, and the Pope literally is on the battlefield. He's there, like leading troops and stuff. <laughs> battle Pope. But we killed him like every time. But yeah, it's still quite funny. They're hiding a lot of men in those trees. Okay. Right. Okay. So what I'm going to do since this has been called um what's our family tree like? Ulrich. Okay. Cool. King Magnus is up there. 33. Ulrich's 20. Okay. Had him when he was 13. Jesus. Okay. Um Okay. So if there is a crusade on we'll go for it. Now this is this is a very important turn. So we need to switch our switch what we were doing. Um we will no longer be going after England. Okay. What is it you wish to discuss? 
You no longer want to go after England. No, we cannot. Well, that seemed fruitful. Farewell. What Magnus is going to do, like though, ever. is um, swap places with somebody. We need a noble to come down here and basically run the show. So I'm going to do is go to Oslo. Um, Eistein, okay. Where are our... There's two there. Where's the... Here he is, Prince Ulfric, okay. Um, so Ulfric, who's 20 yes. years of age, is going to come across to here. We move onward tomorrow. Um, Oriensen, the guy there. Okay, okay. So, and um, this guy. Canute my lord. is going to making camp here, Lord. Yes, gonna take lord. care of England for us, or take care of the Brit British for us, the island. Um, so what I'm going to do is build up a decent army over here in Inverness with Nut, no, Canute, sorry, and he's going to come over here and basically rule from Edinburgh. Um. Your will shall be obeyed. Uh, Harkin is going to come back home. And he's going to take on, eventually, Novgorod. And Magnus is going to take the troops who are being built here. Some of them. He's going to join the crusade. Okay, that's, that's the plan. That's the plan now. So we can get a... Uh... Can I help, my lord? Is there something I can do for you, noble lord? We cannot quite accept this. Both wise and generous of you Good. to agree. We're now and allied with the Pope. Proposition? We shall listen, of course. We'll give you a grand just as a signing bonus to our team. It seems we have reached an agreement. Good goodbye. It has been a pleasure. <laughs> so now all of a sudden, yeah, Pope's starting to like us now. Okay. Starting to like us now, which is good. So. Everyone's going to be moving around, which is fine. Uh, where's our ships? We did have ships here. One of you needs to take... One of you needs to take Magnus home. As ordered. So you Magnus needs to come back and be Never. crowned. Get marching. And we need... Yeah, yes. okay, cool. Right, so all change. All change. Oh, we killed that Scottish diplomat because, yeah. <laughs> Reasons. <clears throat> we'll bring a few assassins with us on, on Crusade, why not? So we're going to have a massive force of Crusaders. <clears throat> and we're going to have a huge fleet. Huge Viking fleet heading to the Middle East. See the size of that English army that's there? That's worrying. I'm hoping that, we, that may reset our reputation. Because I think going against the post wishes basically gave us a bad reputation with everybody. So we were untrustworthy. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping King Magnus being there now, it'll it'll, you know, do us a good a good turn. <clears throat> and for now, we're gonna fight against. Um, Our forces are hidden well here, my lord.
Cool. Magnus now, now has a Master of Assassins in his retinue, which is good. My lord. Set sail. I will make them fear you. More than once, men. Yes, my lord. We can sail no further today. Yes, lord. Head aboard, men. We can move pick on you up, where actually. to? As ordered. Yes. We go no further this day, my lord. Yes, lord. Men, march. Making camp here, lord. <clears throat> We need this English army to not do anything. I am neither your concern nor your subject. And on. How can England help you? Yeah, you're friends with all of our friends, so you know. I am not quite able. The pleasure was all ours. Farewell. Yeah, I think they're gonna go try and go to war with us. I really do. Does this look like one of your fleets, you galoot? Okay. Can I help? You have a proposition for us, noble ally. You are very reasonable. Thank you. Good. Means that he's really starting to like us now. But he really loves England, though. That's the problem. Ah! He's training up our assassins to do some good. Okay. Yeah, the um, the Middle East is shockingly powerful right now. But England aren't attacking us, which is good. Which is good. We just want to make sure... Oh, it's crashed. I wonder why that is. Let's do that again, shall we? It should have um, auto-saved. Does happen. So, uh, yeah, we just need to end our turn, I think. Yep. Is it true? Yep. Watch him die now. No, okay, good. Golden Horde are going to be a problem when we get over there, but that's a problem for another day. It really is. Um, cool. 
Cool. So. Uh, the armies in the Middle East seem huge right now. Which is a problem. Which is a definite, definite, definite problem. Oh, uh, the crashing, by the way, that's just something that happens with the recording. Um, this mod's really, really, really stable. It just Medieval 2 does not like being recorded, and this mod pushes the engine to its absolute limits. So it really doesn't like being recorded once you get past a certain point in the campaign. Turn 50 is normally the round, round about the point where, you know, it can crash every now and again. But, um, not too bothered. It, you can you see how quickly it is, it is to get on to the... Uh, as long as it doesn't crash in the middle of a battle or, you know... Most of these we can now get rid of, actually. I like the fact that he's got his own retinue. He's got his own many, actually. To hit. Do you know what? You may as well get back on the ship, mate, because um, you're going to be. Loading up the men. Resupplied That's by another armor? You have a proposition for us, noble ally. I see no problem. Goodbye. It has been a pleasure. Always worth it. But guys, can you be allies with me, for God's discuss. sake? Come on. I do not believe. An honor and a pleasure. Farewell. Wish to parley, noble sire. Send an emissary. Hmm, you just make me want to conk you even more, to be honest with you. Very wary of England at the moment. That's why we've got a um, nobleman on his way, just so he can repel them. You know. I like the fact that it auto saves as the turn you click turn end as well, because other total wars they auto save as the turn starts, which you know if you click turn end and then it crashes, you've got to do the entire turn over again. Which is annoying. And a turn report. Okay. Okay. Still making a lot of money. That's good. Um, 
to you guys. You have our two family members, don't you? Okay, you're going to come over here. Um... Yes, back ashore, man. Yeah, uh, you're gonna get orders, my lord. Back on, making yes, Ulrich, you're gonna come over here. Men, march. In fact, you can probably get resupplied from there to be honest with you. Orders, my king. Nope, not quite. My okay. lord. Yes. But you can take my these two. Men, march. Combining troops. Yes, my lord. Yes. My lord. Yes! Orders, my king! Move out! Forming one force! Yes! Down! My lord! Okay. Set sail! We can Take sail king no further with you. today! Um, we're gonna build a massive fleet here. A longboat. Want a longboat. And da. Combining fleets, my lord. Should be all we need to do for now. Please, that's all I need. A target, please, that's all I need. As you wish. On my way. A target, please, that's all I need. King Henry the Merciless, is there? Yes. I will leave nothing standing. Some lucky? Who is my target? The target, please. That's all I need. My siege is most subtle, my lord. Cool. Feudal fortnight. Also, so we can get up there. Excellent. Yes, my lord. Greetings, good friend of the Reich. Hmm. Okay. Until next time. I'm getting ready for the Germans to um, attack us whilst we're away, but you know, you never know. People seem do seem a lot more reliable in this mod than they do normally, which is nice. Um, I just know the English are gearing up for war. You can just see it; they're just, they're just ready to try and kick us out and take all of Britain. But hopefully with our nobleman over there, he's going to get over there, he's going to be able to recruit mercenaries if he needs to, he's going to be able to, you know, just do a lot more for us in that area. Look at the amount of armies they've got, we need to be able to keep to keep them away um, if they do declare war on us. You know, it's all about checks and balances, it's all about keeping the enemy... You know, as we go toward war with Novgorod and with Egypt, those are two big outlays that we're doing. So we do need to keep things calm in Norway, in the homelands, and in um, in England. We need to keep things just just nice and uh, quiet. That's what we need to do. Where to? Yes, my lord. Da. Combining fleets, my lord. Orders, my lord. You Edinburgh guys are going to bring Canute to Edinburgh. As ordered. Where he's going to rule for us. us Captain. We sail tomorrow. Whose time is up? The target, please. That's all I need. Um, who is my target? Oh the God! Target, please, that's all I. That's need. a really high-level inquisitor who just turned up, and he could decide I to. I will um, see you brought to justice in a. Whose time is up? 
A target, please. That's all I need. They shall bother you no longer. Mm. Okay, I'm losing track of what I'm supposed to be doing. Ah, okay. Yes. Yes. Forward! Orders, my king. Joining forces. Orders, my lord. I know he's going to try and kill my um, king, isn't he? Yeah. Yes, my lord. We can sail no further this, today. This uh, inquisitor. Most da. definitely. Set sail. The wind has failed us, Captain. We sail tomorrow. Okay, can I help How you? can England help you? Just give me what I want. Come on. I am not quite. The pleasure was all ours. <laughs> Farewell. English are as pig headed in this as they are in real life. And Who Brexit is my target? Never ends. The target, please. That's all I need. As you wish. Whose time is up? The target, please. That's all I need. The target, please. That's all I need. His days are numbered, my lord. Would you wish to establish new trade links? Perhaps I have something you wish. I don't really do much with the traders, with the merchants. I can do, I know they can earn quite a lot of money. It's just not a lot in the grand scheme of things and you need so many of them to, to actually make a difference. It's just another layer of faff that I could do without. Um, it's called total war, you know what I mean, not total trade. Uh, they like hiding in those trees, don't they? They really do like hiding in those trees. They keep marching up to the border and then marching back again. It's disconcerting. Wow. Well, I think Scotland are now part of the Holy Roman Empire. Aren't they? Vassals, yeah. Scotland are now vassals of the uh, <coughs> of, uh, Holy Roman Empire. Which is good. Where to? They're part of our little power block. As ordered. Da. Heading to shore, my lord. Yes, lord. Good. Where to? And course We continue. Yes. Of course. He's nearly ready to go on the crusade, which da. is good. Off this vessel at once. Your will shall be obeyed. You should fear us coming. <sighs> Just destroyed the last nothing less than death. of the Danish nobility there. Yes. My lord. Set sail. Now wait for the Oh yeah, have Heresy a go at him. Cannot hide from me. Get rid of that get rid of that merchant, my friend. That's what you want to do. All these merchants round here, they're all they're all heretics. They need to go. Um I think that's us for now on this. Yep, we're gonna. We want to take our 
Who is my target? Uh, you're actually getting pretty old, don't you? So you can. A target, please. That. That's all I need. Yeah, he died. Okay, Death fair enough. Approaches. I'm oh, not bothered about him dying. Where in the hell is he gone? Whose time is okay. up? Do you know what? You're a good assassin, so you come down here. On my way. And um, stopping here, Lord. You're Who an is my target? Okay, assassin. You are Whose time is up? Quite an old assassin, so you can just you know. One. We'll make a new one as well to go over the seas. We need a we need a diplomatic corps to go with our crusaders. So we'll have one priest, one of each, and one of them. Hopefully the English have moved too late now. Like, like we're going to have troops up there pretty soon. And Inverness is such a high level castle. And if we can take Novgorod, and we can take a few cities on the coast there, with Harkin, should, uh, with um, Magnus, sorry, should mean that we're going to be making a lot of money to pump into the war economy. Elsewhere. Yep, you can have one of those there. Thank you. The Pope's given me a gift. Which we'll then spend on some troubadours. My target, as you wish. Where to, my lord? Da, yes, my lord. Merging it's a large fleet. Ordered. Orders, my lord. That's too late to join the crusade. God damn it. What? Don't understand that at all. We, mm -hmm. oui, your money is good with us. Now he's getting 945 florins a turn. It might be worth me doing that. You convinced me. You convinced me. The thing is, there's no other way to get Whose rid of them. Time is up. There's no other way. A target, please. That's all I need. Get us more money for the war effort. Oh, 
I <laughs> said before, it's like, it's called a, a war total war, not bloody merchant total war, is it? Well, all of a sudden I see that one number, I'm like, oh, let's build some merchants. <laughs> Kingdom of France. I hope that means that the crusade's about to end, because then we can declare another one pretty soon afterwards. Um. Otherwise, we've got a big, expensive army sitting there doing pretty much nothing. Which is rather annoying. It does, it does give us more time to, uh... To raid. Right. I will make them fear you. Arkin, you're gonna have your retinue of big folks there. Forming one force. You're gonna have some Alters Viking raiders because we need Viking raiders yes. and some Scots. My lord. Because why not? Combining troops. Uh, we'll have some Alters, archers. Yes. Joining forces. And. Orders, my king. Forming one force. Get rid of this unit. Now, we we'll have one horse skull, one landsman, three raiders. Two scouts. Some of these, we don't need them anymore. Hopefully, it'll mean they're going back into the local population as well, which would be great. Cool, so agents ready to trade. Are you doing anything? Ready to trade. On my way. Setting up a trade route. There we go. Ready to trade. Yes, I shall trade this resource. Good. Have any traders around here? Ready to trade. You have spotted a business opportunity? So, who is a bit too wealthy then, my king? Setting up a trade route. Cool. Who is my target? A target, please. That's all I need. A target, please. That's all I need. A target, please. That's all I need. Yes. yes, I will leave nothing standing. Good. <clears throat> Keep doing that. So we're recruiting units there. Um, for the raid into Novgorod. Which is good. 
Your will he shall be will obeyed. be a crusader. I just... Yeah. An order! It's too late to join the crusade. Annoying. Yes, Lord. What is it you wish to discuss? My final offer. This is my final offer. I do not. Okay, that's it. An <coughs> honor and a pleasure. Farewell. That's it. We're no longer even entertaining. Um, being friends with them. To be honest with you, I think we're done now. Is there any trade resources around that we can take? I got something new to bring to the table. You know what? I'm probably going to um, recruit a new assassin and take great interest in his career. Like, I'm going to try and build him up to be like a super assassin. And he's just going to clean house up there and kill all of the merchants that we don't want on our wares. Crown of Aragon. My lord. Orders, my king. Yes. Move out. Combining troops. Your will shall be obeyed. An order. What works can you do? Um. Three. We shall not relent ever. I think we've got more merchants over here now, which is good. Ready to trade. Yep. Yes, I shall trade this resource. You do that. I think something I, did, I didn't like about them is that there's no actual feedback of when they've done something or when they haven't, do you know what I mean? So it's not there's nothing on the screen telling you the trading that they've got to tell you verbally. Setting up a trade route. Which it always freaked me out. So, what? Does this look like one of your fleets you galoot? Are you confused? This is not your fleet. Whose time is up? Protecting the troops. 
It's going to be our main assassin here. Let's create him from. A Kunarsen. I can't have any more. Okay, fair enough. I might just send him over there anyway, you know. Been a remarkable time of peace, isn't it? Quite a long time. I'm actually going to rename this city. Um, My lord. Yes. Lord. Yeah, as forces. Magnus sets out, he renames Naiko Ping as Harkun Fjord. There we go. Because there's fjord, so there's a river here. Fjord. Bridge. Harkin Fjord. Your will shall be obeyed. Boarding now. Now he's setting off for. Yes, my Novgorod. Lord. We can sail no further today. And why can't we join the bloody crusade, my friend? I really want to send them down there anyway, to be honest with you. I really do. What we'll do with him then? Up the men. Bring him round here. Then he can just take up Sala before As he. Anchors away! They continue tomorrow. We may as well get a load of money from Novgorodian lands. 
That means by the time that the crusade ticks over, and we can actually join one. Oh, seriously. We must fight or forfeit now. The enemy has laid siege. Did you notice how that happened? The second I moved everyone over there. Where did they even come from? What fleet were they on? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? But, uh, I'm not impressed. This is bollocks, this. Absolute bollocks. Really is. I mean, I mean, it is, isn't it? Like, like, like the fact that I move people over there, and the the second I do that, the second I take that massive army and go, do you know what? Just put it over there. It it then decides. Oh, oh, um, now's the time. Yeah, let's magically put these armies here. Um, no idea how they got there. There's no fleet there, at all. There's nothing, you know. No, no, no. The fires of independence burn oh. brightly in Scotland. Weary of aggression from its neighbours, a new hero has emerged to unite Scotland's clans. His name is William Wallace. A minor noble he may be, but behind him march thousands of warriors, each one with freedom in his heart and a sword in his hand. Ah. And there he is. Okay. Okay. This could prove costly. William Wallace may have just uh messed a few things up for me, but Where to? We are gonna get yes, that settlement back pretty quickly. We can sail no further today. And our plans remain for Harkin to come over here. As ordered. The wind has failed us, Captain. We sail tomorrow. Um, Can I help, my lord? Is there something to discuss, my good man? Not really. I mean. Not quite goodbye, my friend. Uh, uh, guess we'll end this one there. Very annoying. I'd welcome a trial by arms to end this feud. Okay, he's building stuff to attack us. We've got quite a good army in there, actually. Yeah, we do. Quietly confident, to be honest. Quietly confident. Not quite the same as confident. Um, but we do have a big army coming across, no. and when he gets here, he's going to have lots of mercenaries as well. So, there's that. One thing he may have done for us, though, is um, we're now no longer allied with the biggest nation in the game at the moment, which is the whole Roman Empire. They were keeping us safe from a lot of rubbish that was going to be going on around here. And they're within marching distance of our house, which is one of our biggest cities. So, the plan is, currently... Our plans have changed. I said things change very, very quickly. No more crusade. Okay. We'll save it for another day. Next time. We'll be fighting against Wallace here. Hopefully beating him as well. Hopefully. If we don't, that's fine. As long as we, we take down his army so there's pretty much nothing left. They will waltz in here and take Aberdeen. We will take... Gunmar over here. Give him lots of mercenaries. He takes back Edinburgh very, very easily, hopefully, and then just marches straight back up north and takes Aberdeen. 
that's the plan. That's the plan. Quit that, you damn schooner. Um, and of course, to get more money, we are going to have our king, Harkon, wherever he is, over here. My lord. He's going to land here, take Novgorod, burn it, and continue taking land over here. That's the plan. So we're staying in the north for now. And then maybe once he's earned the stripes a little bit down here, Ulfric, our our Vertu. esteemed factionaire, then maybe he can go on crusade. We'll see. Thanks for watching. Speak to you later.